one would have hurt. Yeah. So <laughs> Hello. My name is Aaron. My name is Aaron. Uh, Josh. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> You're fired. Oh, dang it. Again. <laughs> this is like the third time this week. This is only like the third work day this week. It's Thursday, you dummy. Oh. <laughs> Monday was a holiday, you dummy. <laughs> You're fired. <laughs> no! I'm taking over Aaron as her film corporation. No. One day I come in, you're sitting down and be like, Aaron, this is the Aaron Esser Films Corporation board. You've been terminated. Your Nerf gun games lately have been very lacking. Aaron, we have a new idea. We're firing you because we want to make the Emoji Movie 2. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> Nerf edition. Hey, what's going on, guys? Aaron here and... Josh. Hello. Today, we have a bunch of blasters that I've just acquired over the last little while. So we thought, hey, let's do an unboxing video. Yay. Yay. Just to let you guys know, my upload schedule and the way I'm going to be doing videos is going to slightly change in the future. I think it's going to be for the better. Lately, over the last like two years, I've been doing videos every Thursday afternoon. I don't always meet that goal, but the next little while may not be weekly uploads as I'm going to start working on more passion projects, projects that are bigger, lots of fun videos that I want to do. So uh, the upload schedule might be a little bit different for the next little while. If we do get something on a regular basis, I will let you guys know. But until then, just sit tight, relax. The videos that we're going to be coming and making are going to be epic and things that I I'm super passionate about, so stay tuned for that. Without further ado, let's go! So I have the Nerf Modulus Mediator. Mediator. Mediator? 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 It's Mediator. Mediator? Mediator? It's official. It's the Mediator. I came up with the name. It's great. Yeah. Which one do you have, Josh? I have the Zombie Strike Rev Reaper. Rev Reaper? Rev Reaper. Rev Reaper. That's what it looks like. Rev Reaper. I think it looks really stupid, honestly. It seems interesting. <laughs> it seems... It seems interesting. All right, so this is supposed to have a bunch of attachments that you can buy with it, which it doesn't come with. It comes with upgrade to Mediator XL with the Mediator stock or the Mediator barrel. Of course, they make you pay. Hey, I'm covering Josh. <laughs> um, like, I'm sure they're each probably like 20 bucks. Of course, I couldn't find them, so on Amazon.ca, this is all you could buy. I'm sure that scissors. Uh, I'll go grab a pair of scissors here. Hi, my name's Josh, and I'm here to talk to you about the dangers of Nerf Blasters. I don't know what they are. I'm just here to talk to you about them for some reason. Oh, hi, Aaron. You're fired! What did you do? <laughs> what did he say? It was all a lie. <laughs> Remember, safety first, kids. Yeah, you'll shoot your eye out. Okay, that's interesting. That's just like a freaking massive open hole on this thing. You can actually see the chamber, unless, oh, I'm stupid. <laughs> This goes over top like this, doesn't it? Yeah. Wow, I'm dumb. Oh, wow. The magazine it goes in from the top? Yeah. That'll be interesting. Well, I honestly think it looks really stupid. Come on, Nerf! I also need to get the merch done for my second channel as well. Sure. YouTube.com slash Stratosphere. The Stratos Gaming Channel. Josh is the, the main primary editor for it. Yay! Top-notch quality Fortnite videos or streams on a daily basis. Yeah. Ding! Subscribe! All right, so it's a decent size for the mediator. Pop this guy in. Ah! It's all right, nothing special. It's just a spring-loaded blaster that you pump. Clips on the side is kind of interesting, I guess. It's kind of bulky. It is kind of bulky. It's kind of like a retaliator or something, but then it just has like all of this extra whatever. I think it should have come with the stock and the barrel on the front. I don't know why they even have the option. Maybe they'll sell more units or something like that if it's separated. I don't know. So I'm not that big of a fan of this right now, but it's it's okay. I guess it, it works okay. It's no different than like an, a retaliator or something like that. If you, And if you like those type of blasters, I'm generally not a big fan of those type of blasters, but if you are, then 10 out of 10 IGN. All right. And this one is a top loading blaster with the magazines up here. There's a button on the back there to release it. So you can pull it out, put it in. Did you not have to prime it back? Um, I think it's a blaster where when you prime it back, it fires. There is no trigger on this blaster. What are those? Whoa. I take it back, it's awesome. Okay, that's pretty cool. The added sound effect is pretty awesome. This is the best blaster ever, right here. It's still gonna be hard for accuracy, like Mike said last time with the pulling back instead of yeah. the full trigger. It doesn't take much effort to fire. That's cool. It's super loud though. It's much louder than it should. Never gonna use that in an airport. It's like, where's Josh in the house? And all you're in the background. <laughs> It's not even like 
There's no, there's no chainsaw attachment or anything? No, Dude. but there's the <laughs> minor like saw looking thing on the, the side. Chainsaw right there. Dude, what would have made this so much better is it took that like momentum of the gears and like added it to a chainsaw that was like right here. Like the other zombie strike blasters, like you went like that, and it spun and yeah. shot a dart at the same time. Yeah, that looked really cool. It's garbage. It's cool garbage though. I do like the zombie strike clip having the barbed wire look on the top. That's I think cool. it looks kind of cool. I don't know if Nerf has really made specific zombie strike clips before, or magazines, I should say. Not that I'm aware of. It looks all right though. I just think like this is stupid. I don't think it looks that good. The chain and just all the like the weird little, I don't know. It's a cool idea though, but. Nobody got time for that. All right, so I got three Boomco blasters. Another UNSC M6 Halo pistol, but this time it's the ODST version. I saw the yellow and the orange, and I was like, that looks so freaking sick, man. So I had to pick it up right away. This one comes in a bag. Wow. What? As most people know, I'm a huge Halo fan, so I like all the Boomco Halo stuff, even though they don't generally work like super well. They're okay. But the fact that it's Halo means it's 10 out of 10. We got a pistol here. It can fit two straws in the bottom. Because Boomco don't have darts, they're freaking straws. Have you seen this before, Josh? Yeah, Feel yeah. That. So take the tip off and you can drink some water out of a cup with it. Yay! I forgot, you could also store the two straws on the side there so you can hold all five straws that it comes with. Fantastic. From to the top. B-E-A, beautiful. Ah! Don't you shoot Mike in the eye with this one? No. Which one did you shoot Mike in the eye with then? I didn't shoot Mike in the eye. Yeah, you shot him, shot him in the eye with this one right here. No, I didn't. You're a liar. No, I'm not. That one would hurt no. so much. I shot him with the one that's kind of like the jewel, the X shot. Oh! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I You're right. I hit him in the eye. <laughs> There'll be no flashback footage to that happening. Not even a little bit. Guys, make sure you react and subscribe. Oh, are you okay? Oh, I a lot. And I got Aaron's favorite color, the red. I mean, wow. Josh is no longer here with us. He's been fired, so yeah, he'll no longer be in any videos. Just kidding. I um, got him. It's uh, it's identical to Aaron's except for the fact that it's got the red skin, prime, and yeah, it's red. We look epic. Yeah. Intense. <laughs> intense. Real intense. So we also got the Boomco Covenant Plasma Overcharge, even though it's. Pistol? Isn't it, it's always called the Covenant Plasma Pistol. Yeah, just the Plasma Pistol. What is wrong with these people? Do the people at 343 have any idea what they are doing? The answer is no. Literally. I have not made one good decision at that company, I swear to God. Not since like, what, Halo Not 3? since Halo 3, and guess what? 343 didn't make Halo 3. 343 is the company that took over Halo, and they have no idea what they're doing. No one plays Halo, including myself, because of that. Pray to God. That Halo 6 is a good game. They gave some pretty nice sounding promises. The promises are that they're gonna fix the game back to what it originally was. We promise to always include split screen. Yeah, no duh. That's like is the worst promise ever. We promise to make Master Chief be the main character you play as. That's what a Halo is. All right, so we got a, a straw can fit in the front and then you can fit four straws in the bottom here. And then it's just like an Halo where if you hold it back long enough, it overcharges. I gotta wait Yeah. for it to cool down. Thank you. Another time. We have Josh's favorite blaster. Ooh, is it purple? The purple. Why is it your favorite blaster, Josh? Um, cause, uh, purple? It's your favorite color. And yet it's only got like one thing really that's purple and it's the dart holder there. By the way, this is not actually my favorite blaster. Isn't isn't pink your second favorite color though, Josh? Not at all. What if I told you blue is my second favorite color? You can be second in command of the blue squad. I will be blue squad leader and you are the blue squad leader fill-in when I'm not there. Okay, so I've been calling myself the blue team squad leader, which I am, and everyone was like, isn't Josh the blue team squad leader? You guys don't understand. Josh was the fill-in of the blue team squad leader. He was the backup when I'm not there, okay? I was only the blue team squad leader so Aaron could film. <laughs> yes. Blue command, this is blue squad leader. We're pinned down. We need as much help as we can get. So here I got the Marvel Nerf Black Panther Vibranium Vibranium Strike Gauntlet. Black Panther, my favorite movie ever. Not, this thing feels really cheap. So it fits one dart in the front and there's a spot right beside it for storage. Is that correct? Yes, even though it 
Why would it not have the option to fire both? Ugh. This thing is cheap, man. This thing is not good. And then the third dart that it comes with has no spot to go. So we're gonna prime it from the side. Got him. No. Then you gotta switch this over to this. Switch this like that. Squeeze! Come on, there we go. Honestly, this thing feels ridiculously cheap and it should have the option to have all three darts in the front and then you can just fire one at a time in a row, but apparently not. So this thing is really miserably cheap and don't get it. It doesn't come with an extra dart to put in the nozzle, whatever you want to call that. It uh, it comes with the five dart holder on the top. You wow. put them all in, and you take one out, specifically the purple one. You put it in the front, you pull back, and you fire. That didn't fire very strong at all. What? What happened? <laughs> Please tell me it shoots harder than that. Pull back it like as far as... There you go. Okay, that was I better. didn't pull it back. That was better, but enough. even then, that still wasn't that strong. Nope. Come on, Nerf! Yeah, that was better. Guys, I've been waiting to get this for like months and I finally was able to buy it off of Amazon.ca. Finally was available. <gasps> the Dude Perfect Nerf Sports Biggest Nerf Bow Signature Bow Arc. Let me see this. It's freaking Ooh. massive. I'm a big fan of the Dude Perfect guys. They are a ton of fun. Their videos are 10 out of 10. High quality. I love watching them. They're a ton of fun. Great YouTube influencers. I think Nerf made a good decision to work with those guys. Let's open this up and do some crazy trick shots with it, Josh. Okay. Okay, so last time I did a showcasing blaster going over Nerf guns or Nerf blasters in the video, I talked about the Nerf Rival Chaos and its magazine, and everyone was like, Aaron, you're loading it wrong. Aaron, you're so stupid. Aaron, that's not how you load the magazine. Because I was loading it like this, which is true. This is not the proper way to load the Chaos Magazine. Oh, I clearly don't know how to load it because I didn't even put these down yet. Aaron, you forgot that you could take the top off, Aaron. There you go, oh my gosh. Truthfully, I did forget last time I did the video I hadn't used the Chaos in over a year, I think. Yeah, I probably hadn't used the Chaos in over a year, so I just forgotten how to use it. Here we go, I will load it correctly. I deeply apologize for my mistakes. I hope you guys can learn to forgive me. Your favorite YouTuber of all time, greatest YouTuber on the channel, he sometimes makes mistakes, okay? And if you can't seem to forgive Aaron, go watch his identical twin brother, Stratos, play on the Stratos channel. He is great. He do not. He's a jerk. He's terrible at video games. He's not nearly as good looking as me. No. Okay, so we got it fully loaded here. Then once we close this thing, it's completely easy. And then we can put the tabs on the bottom back here. It'll be fine. So I just forgot to mention that. Was that on purpose? Yeah, it was impressive. <laughs> That's why I don't load it that way. When we were filming Nerf Gun Game 5, that happened to us like two or three times. It didn't happen to me, it actually happened to my friends. So that's why I usually don't load it that way. And I don't even use the chaos that much anyway, so. That's why. You guys are correct though. That is the correct way to load it. I've had too many times where you accidentally to push the button and all the freaking balls go everywhere. I hope you guys will forgive me. Holy <laughs> crap, this thing is huge. What? It's not even fully like Hanzo. There's still some other pieces that go with it too that aren't attached yet. Where's the screw? What screw? There's a screw that goes in it right here. Where's the instruction manual? Holy smokes, this thing is big. Unfold arm bow, holding it firmly positioned bow on flat surface stone and push bow arm down until it clicks into place. It literally tells you to put it flat on the ground and like push it until it clicks. That did not sound good. I know. Oh, there's a screw right there. Oh, it's, it is in there? Oh. Dude, this is insane. <laughs> it's massive. Look at that. Definitely earns the name of being the largest Nerf bow. <laughs> Freaking Hanzo, man. Does this thing raise up? Since it comes with like two tubes, you can change. Wowza. Oh, that was sick. Since the target thing comes with two of these long tubes, you can uh, change the height because they just get connected with this like piece that goes in between them. Dude, this is cool too. So like, it seems weird that it like is not flat in the bow and then when you pull it back, it like pops it up. When you have enough tension, it pulls it up and pulls it like flat. That's cool, man. Nice. You see that it's got the target thing in there too? Like the, the view. I think you can change it actually. Yeah, you can change the height on it as well. Nice. Cool. My ultimate is ready. I am ready to unleash the dragon. Ryu ga wa ga take him How does he say it? take him My ultimate is ready. Ryu ga wa ga take him 
And that's how Aaron's nerf room was destroyed. So to compare the size with the Thunderbolt, no, you gotta put the Thunderbolt in front. Here, we're gonna back up too. <laughs> the size of the one you're holding is looking like it's getting close to... It's like double the size. Getting, yeah, pretty close to double the size. All right, we also got the arrow kit with it, right? Yeah. Which just comes with an extra three arrows, and it came with what, two? Yeah. All right, hold up the target, Josh. You guys ready for this epic trick shot? Oh! Oh! Whoa! <laughs> Wanna go do some epic trick shots, Josh? Yeah, let's let's go. This is where we cut to the epic trip trick shot montage. Are you ready? <laughs> oh! yeah! This is the rainy day, wet, slippery, backflip, trampoline, bow shot. <laughs> Ready? Ready. That was amazing. Yeah, that's how you do it. Totally real. Yep, 100%. No way I would fake that. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! Fear the dragon. Unleash the. Oh! Yeah! Oh! Yeah! Ow! <laughs> now your shoulder went into my jaw and like slammed it backwards. <laughs> Why do you always get hurt? All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. We hope you enjoyed the video. Again, upload schedule is going to be a little bit different in the future from now on. It might not be on Thursdays. It might be on a Friday. It might be on a Saturday. I don't know, but I'll let you know if anything changes in the future. Big thank you to Josh. Hello. For being in the video. And uh, if you guys haven't already, smash that like button. Do it. Smash it. Subscribe to the channel. Also, check out my gaming channel if you want to go see even more uploads. We do daily uploads or streams on that channel as well. So definitely go check that out. Comment down below. Follow me on Twitter. Instagram, Patreon, Snapchat, Tumblr, Pinterest, Facebook, um, YOLO, Google, Bing, buy Yahoo, some merch. buy some, are you freaking kidding me merch? Oh, I didn't realize you were, re what? You're, the, you're hired. That was amazing. I didn't realize you were wearing that. I didn't even realize you were wearing that. It's amazing. Super comfy. It's actually one of my favorite sweaters <laughs> because it's really comfy. Link in the description down below. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.